It's reopening day in LA, which means life is returning to normal, and with it, LA traffic is back. We're gonna check out the streets, see how it is, but there's bound to be more cars on the road. Just judging from social media, everyone is out and about. We'll be grabbing our e-bikes, taking them down Santa Monica Boulevard. There's a bike lane, so it should be pretty safe. I'm gonna grab something to eat. It's a nice, warm 81 degrees here at 5 p.m. The good thing about Santa Monica Boulevard is that it has those bike lanes, but you still have to be really careful. Um, whenever you're biking in LA, you should consider yourself a slow moving vehicle, so you always want to go with traffic, not against traffic, and you want to make sure you're abiding by all of the laws that a car would abide by, so stopping at stop signs, stopping at red lights, make sure you know your hand signals. The streets are pretty busy, but it's not an insane, overwhelming amount. One thing to remember though, when you're biking on the street is, even in the bike lane, you wanna leave around four feet between you and any parked cars that are on the side of the road, just in case someone opens their door, you don't wanna ride into it. And always look out too for any cars with their lights on, they could potentially be pulling out at any moment, so be aware of that. And yeah, so when you're on the, in the bike lane, you want to ride towards the left of the bike lane. And if you need more space, don't be afraid to take over the lane. You really do have to get used to looking over your shoulder without swerving. It's just an essential skill you need to have if you're going to be biking on the road. Because you, you do have to check the cars behind you and you have to be aware of your surroundings. So it's just really important to be able to look over either shoulder, your right and your left, while you're biking without swerving. to go with the healthier option, lettuce wrapped, but it's still a burger. If you're ever stuck at an intersection and the light's not changing because there are no cars behind you or anything, or if you have to turn left and you can't because you can't get over safely to the left turn lane, one thing you can always do is just walk to the nearest crosswalk and then cross walk your bike across with the other pedestrians. And that's something I do typically have to do when I'm on these busier streets and it's harder to get into the left turn lane or I just feel too nervous about it. I'm all, you can always just stop and walk your bike. The streets weren't too busy. We kept it safe. I did have one person open their car door right in front of me though, so it was a good thing I was on the left side of the bike lane because I just had to swerve a little. If you want to see more rides like this, make sure to subscribe and join our exclusive Peddlers group. 
Everyone shares their rides, shares accessory recommendations, we have giveaways. It's a really cool community, um, so I hope you'll join. And until next time, don't forget, it's your journey, your experience. Enjoy the ride.